How's it going guys, Yomtosh here and I've got more jailbreak tweaks to show you so we'll just get straight right into it. The first one I've got for you is called Fluid Tabs and basically with any tab based iOS app you can just slide across the uh, the tab based uh, location and you can like switch through the different tabs on iOS. It's a bit weird with my home bar, especially on my iPhone 7, but it does still work and if you don't use the home bar that's a plus for you. So yeah, that's fluid tabs. The next one is called flexible and uh, it can basically do what it says on its GitHub here. And it's kind of like a debugger tool and you can change a few variables in iOS and it's pretty handy if you know what you're doing. So yeah, definitely do check this out. I think you can use it to make flex tweaks as well. So flex three tweaks. So yeah, definitely check that out if you're interested in that sort of thing. The next one is called safe power off. And in this one, so it, rather than uh, turning off your phone by sliding to shut down, what you actually need to do is hold the cancel button so it's just a neat trick i haven't tried it myself i wasn't risking it yeah oh wow it actually works <laughs> that was close i was i thought i'd have to uh, jailbreak my phone again to continue the video but yeah safe power off it does work the next one is called airport and this basically makes your know, second gen uh, airpods work with your ios 12 device pre iOS 12.4. It doesn't quite work all the way as you can see it says 0% for both of them and I'm pretty sure it's not 0%. It wouldn't show up if it was 0% but it's got that cool dark mode. You can customize a few other things as well. Dark uh, AirPods as well which is really nice and that leads me to BT power so I'll actually just open that again. If I connect to uh, my AirPods now you would see that it will show me a little indicator up there that shows me my Bluetooth power. There it is. So this usually works with headphones, but doesn't usually work with AirPods. But now you can get it with literally any headphones that you connect to your iOS device. That snap. All right. So uh, next one is called Home Bar Media Progress, and I'll just open Spotify here and play this video. And you can see, play this video, play this song, and you can see here. I move the progress over here you can see that little progress bar in my home bar and you can also change the uh, color the appearance of the home bar it's pretty neat maybe you want to like a song and the song is about to end and you're like oh no where's the song now so i can finish doing what i'm doing and head back into spotify to like it or something like that that's what i use it for anyways the next one is called springfinity and springfinity is sort of like an ios app drawer style sorry not ios android app drawer style sort of thing where you can just more or less infinitely scroll through your apps and i haven't taken the time to actually move my apps all the way over here because i'm not sure how it will handle it when I go back into stock iOS which happens a lot because my battery on this phone is pretty pretty poor right now and uh, yeah so you can just add more stuff you can add widgets I'll leave laughing calls video for his development of this whole I'm not sure if it's the same tweak actually but it's very similar and it looks really good you can add widgets as well it's just pretty pretty cool and it's a good departure from the regular swipe left swipe right that we've had for ever basically on ios the next one is called bela and bela basically gives you a simplified 3d touch menu it's no longer the same on ios 13 unfortunately but yeah you can relieve your 3d touch fetishes i suppose on uh, ios 12 jailbreak and ios 12 and literally any other ios well ios 10 to 12 but yeah, that was a uh, Baylor. The next one is Beamy, and Beamy is basically this icon set I have on my screen right now, and it looks pretty good, I have to say. Pair it with like Noctis, Noctis 12, and you've got yourself like a decent looking iOS uh, 12 dark mode. And if you pair that also with, oops, if you pair that also with like, I forget what this name is, but I'm going to leave it there, the name of that uh, volume hot tweak. It looks really good and you can also slide on this one on, on like some of the other uh, volume hot tweaks out there. The next one is called Honey and I'll just turn this on because I actually don't quite like Honey. So yeah, this is a uh, Honey. Look familiar? Yeah, it looks like the Apple Watch. So the only reason I don't like this tweak, I mean, it looks good, especially if you got like a good wallpaper to match it with. But I don't like it because it takes me time to find apps, although they are arranged in alphabetical order so one is over here two and it goes from a b c but then you have to go all the way back if you're looking for something again so that's b again 
and then keep going and going and then yeah that's that's pretty much it so if i was looking for cdf for example so cdf is c y so we somewhere around oh there we go cd right there so yeah that's pretty much the only reason i don't like this app so i'm gonna disable it and continue with the video so yeah uh before i go into the next week this is the uh, flexible sort of thing that helps you debug stuff you can go and select views and it kind of shows you all different elements in my settings app right now so my ui labels my ui views and so basically all the little display elements that actually show up in settings in swift terms if you're familiar with swift the next one is called spose and spose is just a really nice tweak that helps you customize stuff in spotify so with spose you get to do these things so you get the new ui on spotify you can get the car view the car play car view now i'm playing ui you can do something called real shuffle i never knew that spotify didn't actually do a real shuffle but i guess yeah the shuffle play doesn't exactly shuffle the songs it just kind of plays it in that same order and you get voice search as well so all these things are pretty cool if you don't like genius as well you can disable genius you can disable the song videos next one is called live safari and this is just a really nice tweak that kind of like replaces your safari to be live so if you look at my safari icon it's actually pointing to north oops that's out of focus it's actually pointing to north which is really really cool and that's the reason why it's not dark like the rest of the other icons down there but yeah i do like this little touch it's sort of like the clock that's constantly moving as well now you've got safari to constantly point to the north for you the next look is called particles and this is basically part of zen html and zen html has like a really nice update where you can just add widgets from here as opposed to doing it in settings and uh, i'll just add particles to my home screen now and as you can see, I've got particles flying and it's really cool now because you can actually make it only work on one particular home screen. So I don't have it here. And that's just the bug with Springfinity down there. And uh, yeah, you've got particles. I'm, I'm, if you guys have been with the channel long enough, you'd have seen this tweak particularly before. But now Zen HTML is updated and everything is just cooler and works better and the last one i have for you is awesome page dots and because i have springfinity on i can't show you but i'll just show like a preview of uh, awesome page dots right now pretty cool tweak i really like that subtle animation of, from sliding from page dot to page dot so yeah definitely get this one out if you want to deck out your ios 12 jailbreak and ios 12.4 jailbreak is out too so you guys who might have been waiting on iOS 12.4, definitely check out the subreddit and uh, other videos as well on YouTube to jailbreak your iOS device. You come to me for the tweaks. You can leave the installation videos. I can leave the installation videos to all the other YouTubers out there. And yeah, that's been me and enjoy your jailbreak tweaks of the day and probably of the week as well. See you next time. Yom Tosh here signing out. Peace.